Hello everyone, Ransart90. Uh, welcome back to a very, very, very delayed Swoga update. Um, so it's been another few months just due to, you know, real life things happening and all that. Uh, so yeah, we're here. Um, as you can kind of see, a lot of things have changed. Uh, I actually just got hyperdrive for reasons I'll actually tell you very soon. Um, but I'm not going to really go over a ton of updates, um, in terms of what happened since then, uh, since my last update, I guess. The main thing that I will say is that I am full on going for executor, which is why I have the hyperdrive bundle. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll see. And I decided to do it now just because we do have the the bonus drops right now for the Gungan, so like I might as well like if I wait then I still get the boat I still get all this energy but I don't have the bonus drops for the um you know I don't have the bonus drops and then the, th the thing is that I'm not even going to really focus on Gungans because I just don't have the Kairos for it so um yeah we're one unit away from getting the um getting enough to just have everyone at relics um, outside of bam we're gonna have to work on bam too but that's gonna be a little bit later on um we also do have uh, we're not too far away i mean we're kind of far away from getting uh piet to r8 uh, i will need to get um him to r8 like ideally um within two days if I can get it done within two days, I, th I think I'll be um, pretty happy. And I think we're actually pretty close to a, a six-star Phalanx, which is actually pretty good. Um, oh, boy. Come on. Give me give me this. So while I'm doing these, you know, these, these, these Sims here, um, yeah. I bought quite a bit of uh, a bundles last time. So the last Lightspeed bundles I got... Um, everything except the Separatist one, which had, um, so basically I don't have Relic 5 Newt Gunnery, I don't have Relic 5 Count Dooku, and I think there was one other one that, that was also R5 or something, I don't have that, um, so, uh, yeah, because just because in my opinion that, that, that was pretty expensive. Like even even though as I say as I as I as I bought as I have just bought the hyperdrive bundle, <laughs> um, just just in terms of value per proposition wise, it's like eh, I don't know about that. So, um, so yeah, while we're working on these um, double drop characters, right? Uh, not not double drop these bonus drops. Um, what basically happened is that last month. Uh, mid May, I think, I got a roster review review from Nooch, and he was looking at my roster and all that, and he was like, "Okay, why don't you, um, why don't you go, and get this executor up as soon as possible?" Okay, that's, that's I mean, he didn't exactly say it like that, but you know, he, he kind of insinuated, "Okay, well, this is you know your logically next step, and let's see if you can get and try and get it done for next month." I guess he didn't know my uh, my situation, but I was like, you know what? Let's give it a shot. <laughs> so I, I started everything from R12. So Piet was R12, Boba Fett was R5, Vader was R5 as well. So I basically had everything from the bundles, right? So Vader was R5, Bosk was R5, which meant I didn't have to worry about it. Boba Fett was R5, which meant I needed to give him three, um, three more relic levels. Piet was gear 12 at the time ig88 dengar type fighter pilot were like gear 8 at the time when i started all this so um it's been around two weeks since then because i, I because uh i got my roster review with with like three weeks before the the next executor event which is going to happen in um what day is today today is june 6th right so it's going to happen in nine days which is going to be pretty close pretty insane so um i also bought the i bought a couple gift cards because there was a gift card promotion 
um, in Canada, it was from Circle K. So you, if you bought a hundred dollars in, was it a hundred dollars or was it seventy five? I don't remember. But if you got a twenty five dollar gift card and a fifty dollar gift card, uh, you get that amount in crystals as well. So I, I got an extra, you know, fifteen thousand, thirteen thousand, fifteen thousand, something around there, crystals, as well as uh three thirty Anakin and Vader shards. So that was a lot of shard shop currency. That was close to 30,000 shard shop currency. So that, that was pretty interesting. Um, so we spent it all just on these executor requirements. So um, yeah, anyways, let's kind of go back into this here. So we still have 525 energy. I'm debating whether we should use this for this. I mean, it doesn't really... Yeah, let's use it for this. Let's just, let's just get what whatever we can done. Um, so... Conquest wise, I'm not going to focus on characters. I'm going to focus on signal data um, because I really need the signal data. So, yeah, these drops are not very good right now. So, 72 out of 50. So, I need 100 of this um, just to, I guess, quote unquote, um, don't have to worry about getting Mark II. Um, there's, there's also some other. Uh, great developments in in my account at least that I'll talk about you know once I finish dealing with all these uh, drops so I have no idea what the drop rate of this is um, probably not high as you can kind of see so so yeah 82 out of 550 so we need a hundred of these so it's gonna be I'm gonna need 18 more of those um, so yeah we'll, we'll, we'll see we'll see um, so I think now we have is mod and regular energy okay who needs mods um you know what i've, I've been trying to work on bosk mods for a while so let's see what we got here pray no that's defense that's eh, not too bad but it's not what i want um okay so i've been trying to get more and more speed just for gak and everything um, like Piet, I'm trying to get more speed, but I've, but because of the drops, I haven't been farming, I've been farming upgrade materials and not the, um, not more mods themselves. So that, that is unfortunate. Um, so this one I'm going to probably going to get rid of eventually. Um, this one, yeah, sure. We can, we can sim a little bit here. So I'm I'm probably at close to just not to just not focusing on mod energy as much just because of my um, cuz I've been spending a lot of um, crystals just to speed things up a little bit and I think I might have to drop mod energy um, because it's just really too much for me right now. I can't I can't deal with this. <laughs> It's like, it's like, um, I'm, I'm basically spending borderline 400 crystals a day and I don't, and, and I basically have, and to get that, because I'm in a rhodium two right now, I basically have to win in GAC, which, you know, doesn't really happen. Um, oh my gosh, that's so bad, which doesn't happen because you know, I'm facing these god rosters, which have four, three, four GLs, right? My current opponent has four GLs. Um, and I basically have to pray that he doesn't play. He or she doesn't play. If he or she, they, they don't play. So if they don't play, it's good for me. Like, I was lucky, right? Last round, I had someone who didn't play, so I got a win there. Or they did play, but they, they only did, like, one battle. And then I had someone who, um, by the way, for this one, um, I think what I'll do, because we have another um, assault battle here, which will give me, uh, so I need 50 injector cell salvage. So I need, uh, I need 15 more. So what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm going to try and sim to get 10 more here, and then I'll just get the 50 and not worry about Cairo Tech for that for that instance at least. Um, so yeah, I'm I am still 
winning a lot, right? Thanks to my Datacrons, and people don't use Datacrons in Emporium 2 as much. I'm always the one that has the most, even though other people have like 4 million more GP than me. I'm, I'm, I've gotten used to it. I don't complain anymore because my roster is like 5 point... After Hyperdrive, I've been like, it's like 5.6 or whatever. I don't care about how much GP you have. I care about your defenses. I care about your GLs. I care about, um, you know, what defenses, is, uh, yeah, what defenses you stick on, right? Um, so this one, for, for my current GAC, I kind of misplayed it a little bit. So if he plays, I will probably lose. <laughs> Realistically, I will probably lose. Um, so yeah, it is what it is. Can't really do much about it. Oh my gosh, come on. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? You are ki That's 15 sims without any of that. That's 20 sims without anything. That is brutal. Game, that is so brutal. Um... Sure. Okay. I'm a missing one. <laughs> so it's it's not too bad, right? Like forty four. I'll just I'll just sim and try and get one more, and then we'll do that assault battle, and I'll get my fifty, and then I can I don't have to worry about um, this, right? Because I have three hundred and twelve uh, Chirotech. I actually might because of this. I actually might skip out on this month's. Um, Crystal, so 650 crystals for 25 or 50 Chirotech. I actually might skip that just because technically I bought it, quote unquote bought it. So um, yeah, so we also have 10.4K here. So one thing that I actually learned about this hyperdrive uh, while I'm waiting, I'm waiting for a daily reset so I can finish these challenges here because of the guild activity. So while I'm waiting, while, while we're kind of, while I've, I've just noticed here, right? So if you hyperdrive, you actually get these extra quests, which, you know, is, is, is interesting. Um, so I think are all of these hyperdrive? Let me take a look. So, yeah, there's a lot of hyperdrive quests. So complete one raid attempt. Unfortunately, we just started a raid and it did all eight of my attempts. Um, so <laughs> I'll do I'll get this. I'll get these shards later. Um, so we have here complete one raid attempt. Win in one territory war. Uh, we actually lost our last territory war. Um, and played 20 waves in a territory battle. So TB was very recent as well. So that was unfortunate. Um, deploy 10 units to platoons. We'll just do it next time. That's not a big deal. GW 10 times. So that's 10 more, 10 days to get this done. Uh, 25 arena battles, it'll happen when it happens, right? 25 fleet arena battles, yeah, that's going to take me a month. <laughs> or or depending on when I get my executor, uh, it'll take me a little faster. Uh, level up mods 50 times, that's easy. I think level up mods means just going from 1 to 15, rather than, that's easy. Um, purchase 100 in shipments, we'll get there. I don't know if we'll get there before the 15th uh, when we get the executor event, but 100 items from shipments. Yeah, we'll see. Ideally, if we can get this before, uh, because 250 crystals is basically, you know, 550 refreshes, which is pretty useful. Um, so uh, spend 500, spend, this is just charge off currency, whatever. Uh, and then 10 times for this. So. This we will actually get done. Ooh, unfortunately, we're actually going to get this. We're not going to get this done in time for the 15th. <laughs> because right now it's the 6 and plus 10. That is, or actually, we might make it. Or, I don't know. I don't know. We might. We might right now. It will either be 9 out of 10 or 10 out of 10. I don't know. But, um, yeah. So we do have 4,000 crystals to spend on whatever. So... Um, yeah, squad arena sixty six, fleet arena twenty six. This is the, this is the highest I could go. I can't. I need I need an executor to get in the top twenty, and then grand arena. Um, they haven't attacked yet. I don't know if they will attack. We will see. Okay, so, um, yeah, that is our update.
Um, we'll, we will see. Maybe I might do another update like a day or two from now. Actually, maybe not tomorrow, but maybe, you know, by the end of the weekend. But, and, and take a look and see where we are with the executor, okay? Um, because I'm try I've been trying to rush this a lot. I've been spending 600 crystals a day trying to get this done. So that's the life and I won't have and I won't get a five star executor because um, I just don't I just don't have more crystals. So yeah. That's pretty much our quick update, which is not pretty not pretty much not that quick, but I guess it's a general update of what's been going on. My schedule and life is kind of slowing down somewhat. It will ramp up a little bit in the fall, but for now it's kind of slowing down in in the summer, uh, or, or we're getting into the summer, so I'll have a lot more time to get stuff done, or maybe do provide more updates. Maybe we'll go back and show GAC a little bit. But um, if you made it this far, thank you guys for watching. And hopefully, we can get this on the 15th of June. Have a good one, everyone.